Hey. How's it going? How you doing? Good. Uh, it's cool you finished uh, fucking Witcher. Goddamn. Brain stopped yeah. working. And I, I think I finished pretty much every Witcher side quest except for finding all the Gwent cards. Um, except for the DLC stuff, which I'm still going to do. But I, I really, I have to say, I enjoyed the side quest more than the main story. The main story was kind of... I, I like the, the kind of like day-to-day -day stuff more than the we're saving the world stuff. <laughs> like, let's see what's bothering this village. It It's always been one of the like shining like high points of the game where they're like, it's the side quest. Because like, I do really like the story and it's it's interesting having like kind of a wrap up for like Siri and everybody's story instead of the way the books end. Yeah. But I actually totally agree with you. The fun stuff is when you're out just like... This person had a noise in their barn. Oh my god, it's a werewolf! Yeah. I was sad when I got the achievement for finishing all the contracts. I didn't realize that that was the last one. I still haven't done all of those. I got <laughs> 300 hours. I haven't managed to complete a bunch of that stuff. Damn. Oh, but well, you've done New Game Plus and stuff. Uh, yeah. I've been... I tried doing... Like, I've probably done all of them separately, but not in one one playthrough. I'm almost to a point of grace I'll be able to... I'm actually creating a new character, just because... Oh, shit. Okay. He said to. Um... What's his name? Whose name? I thought I was kind of near a point, but I guess not. Fucking hell. Oh, that's a lot of those guys. Never mind. I jumped down. There's, uh, I'm in the underground sewers under the capital, and there's like a flower with like an item behind it. And I was like, oh, I'll go see what that is. And you jump down there, and there's like four or five of the little the death blight chameleon things or frogs or whatever the fuck those are. Yeah. And I was just like, eh, never mind. <laughs> I fucking hate these guys. I forget what they're called. Yeah, I don't. I don't remember here, but. Annoying as shit. Do any of the keepsakes matter? Uh, not really. Um, what are your options for? I mean, okay, so I think like the best one might be the the Ashes of War, 
because, uh, or like the the, sun, the spirit summon ashes, because yeah. those two guys are kind of good. They they do blood loss, so it's kind of good at the at the beginning of the game. But yeah, I used them for a bit. The, I used them for a bit during the game. You can always use the apple because it'll just, or like the seed or whichever one it is, because then it's just more healing. Um, oh yeah, yeah. The because you medallion. can get. Well, no, the medallion's kind of a bad choice because you can buy that medallion like right at the beginning of the game. Uh, I was saying there's oh. like a there's like a golden seed which helps you expand your flasks. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. That's probably what I picked last time. That or a cracked pot. Yeah, cracked pots are an interesting pot to, part too because you can get one and it just takes away one of the ones you can get later. But you can oh. also buy three from Kale right at the beginning of the map. So what? What about Shabriri's Woe? That'll just make you get targeted more, and it only really works in multiplayer. <laughs> oh, okay. So no. Yeah, it draws. I'll it, get the ambushes then. Yeah, the. I mean, it draws aggro, but if you're the only person, you're the only one who can draw aggro anyway. It doesn't. Your. It won't work with your spirit ashes. Although I wasn't under the impression you could put it, if you were wearing it, you put it on the Mimic, and then you take it off, it, the enemies will attack the Mimic. But the Mimic usually doesn't have any trouble with that. Like, it What the fuck? God damn it! I don't want to blame that on not myself, but my controller might be breaking. I feel like sometimes I press buttons and nothing happens. That could be it. I just saw a mosquito dive bomb me and now I can't see it anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> you, sir, are in a much worse fate. <laughs> So, you got a new character. What you doing with this one? I don't know. Magic's really fun. Yeah, I haven't tried that. Um. I appreciate that classes mean virtually nothing in this game outside the very beginning. Yeah. Right when the game came out, I saw a guy talking about like his suggestions for it, and he mentioned that it, like the first time through, it's probably bet it should you should play as the wretch, which is as flat tens, because then you'll just like when you pick up something and start liking it, you'll just use that. Like it's a, just a, the base game to explore. Don't get like don't put yourself in an avenue right at the beginning. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. And since I think you can, I think it's 18. I think there's 18 larval tiers per playthrough, so you can you can respect quite a few times. That is a lot. <laughs> <laughs> 
I only did twice in my first one. <laughs> yeah, I ran out of tears in my first playthrough with Luthien. Because I switched, like, but a couple times it was like, <laughs> I was using like three or four in a row, like some kind of asshole. Because like I'd spec something and then I'd be like, oh wait, I, I forgot to, I needed like 12 points in, in Arcane so I can use an ability. And I feel like, you know, so then I just have to respec again. But after that, I've, I've never had a problem. Now I've only the last times I respect was because I was switching my character to have 99 arcane so I could hunt for items. I don't remember how far in do you get before you can summon people. I think it's pretty early. Yeah. Okay. There's no glasses, right? It's not part of your appearance? No. I wish. I think there's glasses you can wear as items, but it's probably just for magic. Oh. Okay, so I should be able to just get through this. Yeah, the furled finger can be found at the Chapel of Anticipation, so. <laughs> Alright. I remember, there's the first fight that you're supposed to lose. Yeah, then you'll... Um, well, if you if you win that fight, you can run off the edge, or you have to run off the edge, but if you lose, you die, and it'll send you to the Chapel of Anticipation. Oh, I'm gonna merc this motherfucker. How do you use your ashes? Um, you need your you need a spirit calling bell that you get from Ronnie the first time it's night. Okay, so I cannot get that for this fight. No, you cannot use them. Do you know what barbaric roar does? Uh, it shouts at people, and I believe it gives you more power. Sorry, I'm gonna die. There's no way I'm surviving this. Yeah, I'm dead. That first fight's a tough one on your first run through. I did pretty well the first time because I had a shield. Yeah, if you got a if you got a shield, uh, <laughs> that's a that's your best your best is hope. Because yeah, shit, man. Those guys are annoying. The, I think those are revenants. Um, no, that's a grafted scion. Um, Revenants are the Not other ones. Flask. Um. Okay. Got the full finger.
Well, I am in Limgrave, and I can probably get you in here. Ah, uh, okay. Shuffle around a ri What the sh oh here this is this guy Oh wait I'm gonna have to be able to craft first in order to use that stuff. Uh oh yeah, right. I can probably do that pretty quick though. I guess you could spawn me in, right? Uh yes, I assume I could. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, I could summon you to my game. Well, I might be, I might be able to, because I might have killed everything in the area. But oh yeah, that's right. Um, uh, well, I'm just running to the merchant that sells you the the thing. <laughs> Probably like 500 runes or something. We'll see. Yes. Yeah, so, oh yeah. I guess you need the crafting book to make them, and then you need some actual flowers. He might sell the crafted thing already, though. Oh yeah, I think he does sell furl fingered. I can look at him. I'm standing right here. He does. He does. But they're expensive. It's a thousand each. Yeah. Well, if you if you it's cheaper to. <laughs> oh yeah, crafting right. is three hundred. Okay, I was gonna say. So if you get the crafting book when you summon me, I can drop like I have like sixty or leaf flowers on me. So I'm at the merchant. If you just, I have a sign down mm -hmm. by the, um, by the point of grace. Uh, okay. I I need to craft one. I need to get three hundred runes and craft one first. Oh, there's a flower right outside the door on the way towards the soldiers. Oh, there's two. There's two along the path. <laughs> okay, good. And I just got 400 runes from, uh, from whatever it's called. <laughs> oh, yeah, I guess for this specific, like, attempts, it would have been better for you to have picked the the rune so you, <laughs> so you could turn it in for money. Yeah. Okay, let me buy the crafting kit, and then it should be good. Alright, I'm gonna... Let's see. Uh, I need to... Throw some weapons in my inventory to give to you. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. So far, I only have one Erd Leaf. Uh, well, I mean, you can you just teleport back and save it and restart. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> just wait. There's one further up the path. Uh, what kind of weapons I'll are you interested in? I don't know. I just have a club right now. Uh. Okay. Okay, I can now use the furl coloring remedy. Although, do I still have to set? I have to. What is the p multiplayer password? It was poo. Like poop or something. <laughs> Just poo. P O O. Yeah. All lowercase. Yeah. Alright. Hear it. There it is. <laughs> Alright, I got a couple weapons for you.
just hiding in the bushes. <laughs> uh, I think I'm gonna go home. This guy's <laughs> this guy's crazy. Uh, all right, those will be in my inventory somewhere. What's the thing you make these out of? Earth leaf flowers. Yeah. There we go. That's all. All right. Black knife. Blasphemous blade. I cannot equip either of them. Yeah, you're gonna have That's to probably level up to use a couple of these, but um, I figure this will at least give you. A, this is gonna. This is some good shit here. Do you have anything that has no requirements above ten? I, I probably. Okay. I probably do. Let me. Um, let's solve your. Oh, actually, I'm well, say so we can solve your level problem real quick if you want. That's a lot of weapons. There's so many runes oh, on the ground. <laughs> Heroes runes, oh my god. That's gonna do a lot. <laughs> yeah. Um This is more or less what I've been Lord's rune. These are more or less what I've been saving uh, these for. <laughs> like be crazy. I guess I would say don't feel obligated to take them all at once. Yeah, I have to kind of decide what I want to level up into because I'm not going to be able to respect for a while. Here, I got 94 of these. You can have them. <laughs> Alright, that's probably good on the runes. I'll just use up the rest of my little runes. There's still something else over here as a uh, item. Where? Oh. Um, it's a, oh, that's my level 24 grave scythe. No wonder you can't see it. I meant to give you the level 0 one. <laughs> Did I not pick it up? Oh, I didn't get it in my inventory. Never mind. Okay, so you're good. Cool. Um, what do I want to equip them? Oh, I mean, I guess I can give you armor, too. Let's just use a Lord's Rune. Alright. I, I I'm pretty sure I gave you close to a hundred levels. <laughs> yeah. Probably. But I can't level up with you here. Oh, right. Um... We're super sure about me being out of here. Yeah. <laughs> it's mutual. <laughs> oh shit, I can't level up yet? Oh, um... No, because you haven't met Melania. Or, uh, not Melania. Uh, Melina. 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 Run... Right. All you have to do is get to another side of Grace. If you run just like okay. straight up to the, the gate front ruins... I guess I could have been there for you, but... That's that's where I get uh, the 
horse torrent. Right. Yeah, when you you gotta yeah, you, I think you can go to literally almost any of them. It just has to be a, a little bit away from the starting point in Limegrave. But usually you run up to the Gatefront Ruins or uh, Aguil Lake North. Uh, you'll talk to Melina. She'll inquire about your maidenlessness. I, I love that about this game. As soon as you get there, it's like ah, oh, maidenless. I'm like, dude, don't fucking come on, man. Like. <laughs> I know, you don't gotta bring it up, fuck! Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Discovered. Sitting. Skipping. I guess it won't really matter while we're... Oh, I can grab more stuff for you. Alright, now I can level up. Yeah, I gave you a black knife because I think it's the best weapon in the game. And even if you go with a magic build, you should have enough faith to use it. Uh, well, it's, it's I only never used it in the first one. Yeah, it's 18 faith. Well, just because it's so fucking good. You throw it at the at a boss at the very start. You take off 20% of their health, and it does damage. So, like, there's what's the downside here, you know? Yeah. Okay, so... It gave... One Lord's Rune is enough for 27 levels. <laughs> Fuck out of here with that. <laughs> I'm just going to go 20 strength and 20 dex so that I can use pretty much any of the weapons that don't require faith or intelligence. I think I'll just put the rest into Vigor for now. Hopefully you have some more runes you could get <laughs> in case you want to do yeah. something specific. <laughs> if only you had access to all of them. Okay. Um. I'm going to level up a few more times just as <laughs> I can. I, uh, I don't really see a reason not to. But if you meet me at the gatefront ruins, I can spawn you in after that. So I use two more, and that gets me to another 13 levels. I'm just getting vigor and endurance up a bit now. Alright, and I will use another remedy. Oh no, I already had it active. Shoot. So I think I nullified it. Yeah, if you nullify it though, I'm pretty sure it just goes back into your inventory. Nice. If you select the nullify, at least at least it does if you like you just used it. Because I've done it a couple times where I use it and then turn it back off. Yeah. All right, I gotta sign down. Right. I'll be right back. Oh shit! I'm at Agil Lake North. I meant I meant Agil Lake North. <laughs> <laughs> 
A Gil Lake North? Okay. Uh, let me yeah. skip on down there. Ooh, I'm refilling on my Rune Ones. Golden Rune One, look at that. <laughs> I'm pretty sure with Luthien earlier, I just left a stack of 99 runes on the ground and teleported away from it, because I was like, I don't fucking... I, they're, I've got like 40 or 50 in my 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 chest, so I was like, I don't, I don't need that shit. Alright. Point of... or signs down. Hear it. What I should really give you whenever you decide which weapon you want is some Ashes of War, because a lot of weapons need them. A combo I've been finding really, really good is just a regular sword with the combo or the Ash of War square off. Just the Ash of War comes with, but you have to change it to. Your, your own suitable element. Oh, look at all my health gone. <laughs> ah, you're in a bush again. <laughs> um. Okay, you're gonna want one of these. Sort of night. Oh yeah, that's the one that needs faith and dexterity. It's... I that. It does. Um. Oh. Yeah, I thought about using that at one point. Uh, Alright. Do you have any idea which weapon you want to use? Or like what you're gonna... Mm, I was gonna try this for a little bit, and then maybe I'll try the uh... uh which thing uh, are you using? The cross, oh, the cross Nagakiba? Yeah. But otherwise I was probably gonna try the knight and... Lane. Okay, um... Where the hell is the one I'm looking at? Sword Dance. You can see those Ashes of War, right? Uh, yeah. Sword Dance and Giant Hunt. Alright, let's just get to something. If you 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 want something, we'll Commando Leap! <laughs> <laughs> this weapon is insane. I gotta stop killing everybody. <laughs> I tried that one at one point. I probably didn't. It, it was alright for my build. There's some weapons because oh, of how oh. scaling. I got this. Because <laughs> uh, of how scaling works and stuff. Uh, some weapons, like mid game, are kind of bad and then they become much better later. Oh, really? Is that from how much you level them up, or your own skills? Uh, it's a little bit of both. Like, um, a bunch of weapons. You're gonna want to go down here to get your get a wet blade. A bunch of like some weapons, like their the final scaling adds like 40 or 50 points of damage. Like, the, like going from nine to ten is crazy. Um, so that does help. But then also some of it's just it's your your leveling up. Whetstone knife. What does that do? Uh, it's so you can apply Ashes of War to weapons. Nice. Uh, 
Ooh, I got some armor finally. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I can drop you armor. Um, I don't have any idea what you'd want, but I have it all. <laughs> this is my this, this character has gone around four times, so I've I've got spare shit. Or gone around three yeah. times. I'm on my fourth. Behold, I am Thunder. How many... You can only hold one talisman, right? Uh, I think so. Yeah. Uh, what talisman do you want? <laughs> I don't know. What do you suggest? Um, here, let me, let me just drop a couple, because I got some extras. Uh, that's a good one. A lot of defense. All right. Yeah. Well, I had just noticed I had a bunch of those, the copies of them. And if you're gonna grab, did you grab the weapon in here? It's a long sword, no. so it's or great sword, so it's not that big a deal. Yeah. <laughs> you have the blasphemous blade, you're fine. <laughs> You've got great it's a flail. sword. Oh, it's a flail, the sword's in the other one. Alright. Who do we want to kill? Maybe the the guy in the Um Dark Bridge guy maybe. Oh yeah, it's Knight. Knight's Cavalry should be out. Although maybe they're not out yet because we haven't talked to Morgoth. Did they come out after? It, he tells you to be aware of the Knight, so I, I'm under the impression. He's technically speaking their commander, but... Does he not come out while you're in, or in multiplayer? That's interesting. Sorry, Bach. Oh, no, Bach does come out. Up. As long as you don't kill him, he has a happy ending. I don't remember what happened to him. He. Like I said, if you don't, if you don't give, you can give him a larval tier, um, and then he'll rebirth himself into like a like a. He'll have really long arms, and he's a white-bodied humanoid situation, and then he dies. Uh, cause he doesn't have the great rune of rebirth, so he can't come back to life. <laughs> However, we can. Huh. So if, if you don't do that, you have to have a, you get a, if you get a prattling, the prattling plate that says you're beautiful, that's his mother's voice. Um, and he doesn't... Oh, do you want a shield? <laughs> God damn, I'm terrible. Help him. No, I'm good. Nope, he's here. <laughs> Good. Start this like a pub brawl. Oi, mate! I'm gonna throw a rock at him. I'm barefoot.
repeating thrusts the ring. Cool. Repeating thrusts with uh, a weapon like that's pretty good. Oh, that's going to send me home. I forgot. Oh, because it's uh, that's the boss. Yeah. It's all right. There's another. Uh, we're pretty close to another spot. I'm just gonna run ahead to whatever that flower temple is. Waypoint ruins. Waypoint ruins. I can I can speak? <laughs> I've I've got the technology. I made it to Waypoint Ruins, but I gotta figure out where the actual Point of Grace is. It is underground. Oh, in the middle of it? Yeah, there... There'll be a, uh... I think it's on, like, the south side of it, kind of. There's, like, southeast, there's a stairwell. Um, Sorceress Selen is down here. Young apprentice, you are a tadpole, so now. Which way is southeast? That way. I think it is. I'm. Oh, now it's like right in the middle. Hey, what the fuck is that? It's in a room right next to it. Um, yeah, so the oh, big, the big flowers. It. Yeah, it's down like that corner. Ugh, I'm poisoned. Oh, is there a boss? No, not downstairs. I don't think. There's a boss wall. Okay, oh, there's definitely boss. <laughs> I'll say there's a boss. If you, well, shit. It's two mad pumpkin heads, isn't it? No, it's it's at least one. It's a mad pumpkin head. Yeah, this probably isn't going to go well. Okay. Yep, I died. <laughs> <laughs> um, alright. Sorry. Okay, so I, there's a stake of America. If you meet me there, I can bring you in. I can do it. Where is that in relation to the temple? Uh, closer to the road, kind of along the path to where the trolls are. Alright. Okay, I put my summon sign down right. I'm gonna, oh, I found it right there. <laughs> Stupid. I'm standing right next to it. <laughs> standing right next to it, looking at the horizon, like, alright, it's gotta be around here somewhere. Right below me. Alright, my sign's down right next to it. God damn it. I tried to summon, but it didn't work. You want to put it down again? Never mind. Wait. Never mind. Never mind. It's loading. I guess I'm the fuck is this cracker doing? Just standing here trying to get summoned, summoned to a parallel dimension, and some dude comes up and hits me with his sword. It's fucking rude. I couldn't see that guy, but I saw you kill him. <laughs> Alright. Let's go teach this Betty who's boss. Oh, are you just going inside? To the fight? Yeah, my souls. Okay, this is not going well.
I'll turn this around for you. <laughs> you know what you need is you need a friend with the jawbone of a dragon. <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna send you away then. Uh huh. I like your uh, skirt, no no shorts look, no pants. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta cover my modesty, but I prefer it breezy. Yeah. No shoes either. Uh, okay. Just meet me back outside. Uh, I can't put a summon sign down inside there for some reason. That's fine. Work out. I don't see it there. Uh oh, it's it's back on the way to the stake, America. I'm at the stake. Ah, I will put it closer to the stake. Why'd you get returned? I don't. I don't know. <laughs> it's like try again. Yeah. <laughs> it. It like I did. I got the loading screen. I. And it, I think I got summons, but then it. It was like I was running around. It said unable to connect. See ya. And I got another loading screen. I guess I kind of get why you can't, and there's just some stuff you can't, but I really wish you could bring friends for the Ever Jails. Hmm. I didn't realize you couldn't. Yeah, there's no there's no summons at all from those. You can't bring, like, not even Spirit Ashes. Getting attacked by a lot of people. I see your sign, but it's in the middle of the group. Let's see if I can run through. Kind of. Does that work? I don't think so. I can move it, I'm just down here killing all these guys for, for shits and gigs. Don't mind me, boys. for him probably <laughs> but I'm at half health with no more flasks there he is hmm. he's probably not ready for this oh look he's out
just gonna get my item. Take care of that wood for me, would you? Oh, I got all my fox defense in there. So we can kill No, he's still alive. I don't have any long distance attacks. The dragon might spawn in if we go too far, though. I know, so I was trying to head him off on this side to keep him away from him. That was the wrong button. <laughs> I keep healing because of you. <laughs> oh, killing stuff. <laughs> Fucking pussy, man. After all that, decides to leave.
Might as well just die. It's not like they lose anything. Yeah. Hey, we're back here. <laughs> Okay, well, there's... I guess now that he's gone, we can actually fight the dragon. Yeah. Although, low on flax, but whatever. There we go. It's pretty close to spawn. Yeah, we almost got him. That's funny. Or <laughs> he almost got us. <laughs> Pretty sure I'm not ready for this fight, but I'm sure you'll take care of it. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting there. <laughs> their dragons are hard to fight on foot, like, but, yeah. or can be. Although I always fight them on foot, so I don't know the fuck I'm talking about. Oh, I'm in right in the middle of the road. They're not going to be happy about that. <laughs> uh, Alright, what do we what do we want to do here? I'm going to go a Gill Lake North. Could you give me a set of white armor that you don't care about? Uh, yeah, absolutely. Got a weapon. I don't know what I want to use. I might have already said it, but I'm at a guild lake. A guild must be one impressive bastard to get the whole lake named after him. Yeah. I guess he's a dragon, so. What do you think? A guild. That's the dragon we. It's out there. Oh. Dragons don't respawn. Chumps. Yeah. What kind of weight do you think you can handle? Um, not that much. Okay. I have 67 equip load. And I would like to not fat roll. There's not much in the helmets. That's right, I have a helmet. Alright. Is that good or you want you want more? Something different? No, that's good. Just just more options. Just some armor is good. Yeah, it it really What a disaster that was! <laughs> For him. 
Uh, just everybody, man. He stomped on us, and <laughs> we both fell down. He fell down. Yoo-hoo, horse boy. He's running away. I think he's going to turn around and run back to this side of the... The world just turned. Damn, dude, where is he going? Going back the way he came, so he's still gonna miss us. Shit, shit, shit! I'll intercept him! Man, he's terrible at patrolling. <laughs> I know! <laughs> I'm gonna keep heading him off on this side. <laughs> I'm giving up. He's really giving us the runaround. Yeah, it's really sad about this. He's dead. Oh, I missed. Fuck off, goat! Wait, the horse survived. That's good. Can we ride it? Yoo-hoo, horsey. <laughs> I can target it. God, same thing as before. <laughs> We're just chasing a horse. Oh God. Got it. <laughs> He's jumped over a whole horse. <laughs> I brought a healing axe. What is it? Well, it's, uh, it's just an Executioner's Axe, but the Ash of War heals us. Have some health. Great axes are really sick, too. Yeah. The wolves over there. This way. Oh, there's a side of Bruce. I don't remember this one. I <laughs> say, I don't know if I have this one in... Well, I must have been here before. I haven't been here in a long time, though. Quarter coast. Yeah. I think we can. We're gonna be able to get down. I haven't been to Limgrave. We might have to. Don't you need a horse for these? Yeah. Wait. What's the trick? You try to attack. Yeah. If you if you attack at the edge of a wall and you don't fall off, or you you do fall off, it means you can survive. I've never killed these guys in a single playthrough. I've always rode past them. Really? Oh, it's just like this. Well, there's uh, catacombs at the end of this uh, 
and oh, Murkwater yeah. Cave is a little bit the other direction. We can't enter them without you despawning. Uh, no, but I'd say if we wanted to do it while we were here, I'll just leave and teleport to it. Floating jellyfish. Is there a story behind them? Not that I know of. I don't. I can't think of anybody who's done any real. Like that I've seen any real research on a jellyfish. They just get angry. Oh, this is where Stitches is? <laughs> Patches, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. There he is. Oh, hey, he's on this side now. I got flying blades, too. Oh, that's right. This is the NPC. <laughs> he almost got you, dog. Yeah. Let's try stitches. Oh, because I was a boss. Oh, uh, I forgot about that. Yeah, I was going to send me home anyway, but if we're going to go inside and handle patches. All right, let's do that. I'll probably stop after that, though. Okay. All right, I am at the spot. Okay, I, put, I just put my sign down. Yeah, it's 700,000 I need to level up. brings up the, the different menu. I can't remember what ashes can go on. Oh shit, I should have given you Phantom Slash. That's a way better attack. Um, it's, it's how they, they scale, um, there's so like, keep it standard. What, well, it, I mean, it, dep <laughs> it depends on what you have, uh, points in. I can't remember all of them, but what I, what I always do is I just look like you, if you have the weapon equipped, you can see how much your AR is. And you just have to change the Ash of War to the two, like to the two or three different kinds, to see which which one does the most damage. Yeah. Um, 
I think quality or keen skills with dexterity. So that like sounds like they both sound like the skill with dexterity. They both might. Poison to keep mushrooms in the chest. I am. Ah, uh, here. Let me see if I can drop you. Bulbuses. I'm not poisoned anymore. So oh. No. But good to have for next time. Here. Also. Where's it at? Um, that's a really good Ash of War for spears, I just left you. Nice. It's fun at the beginning when you like a new character and stuff and you're just like, I gotta grab everything. I'm grabbing all the stuffs. Gotta go mess with his chest. Block card. I'm gonna wait in an ambush. I don't want to attack him again because I'll kill him. <laughs> oh, you killed him? <laughs> no. He's here. Oh, okay. Oh, I, yeah, I can see him. He's invisible. On new game, it's worth not killing him because he gives you the man magma whip candlestick. Only a new game? Well, no, he'll give it to you next times, but, um, who cares? <laughs> like, if you, if you, especially if you're not gonna use it, if you have one, you're good for that, that character. Oh, I see. Um, I mean, yes, you, in, technically the magma whips only, it's like, it's really, it's good in the first playthrough, but it kind of tails off. I don't remember getting that. When he moves Anyways, to a mountain. Fun. No, yeah, this was a good time. It's start for a new character. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it though. <laughs> well you got the runes. <laughs> that I do. Thanks for the help. No problem, bro. This was fun.